How can you design a more capable surgical robot? Surgeons want greater freedom of motion, including the ability to operate multiple instruments as closely together as possible. For robotic arms to approach the site nearly in parallel, you need to reduce the effective width of the arm joints. To do that, select strain wave gearing and a high-performance frameless servo motor with the optimum dimensions. Note that a larger diameter motor can allow you to design a narrower joint width. Here's why. The D squared L rule states that doubling the moment arm diameter allows a motor to be one quarter as long axially with no loss in torque. A larger diameter motor can also allow for a larger through bore to accommodate wiring and other components. Tight integration between the motor and feedback devices can also help you minimize joint width. Consider the motor's thermal rating and whether it will be compatible with the gearing lubrication and other temperature sensitive components. Motors should be engineered to fit the application, not the other way around. That's the principle behind the TBM2G series of frameless servo motors. TBM2G motors are specifically designed to optimize the performance and fit of strain wave gearing. They take advantage of the D squared L rule to achieve a short stack length and large through bore. They can be supplied with integrated hull sensors that don't increase motor length. And TBM2G motors operate with an exceptionally low thermal rise while delivering maximum performance. Are you ready to design a more capable surgical robot? Get in touch with a Colmorgan Robotic Motion Specialist and let's get started.